Hello and welcome back. In this class, I'm just going to teach you some more things. And actually, if I just go to the browser, then we just made this beautiful view of the dashboard. What more I just want to add after the latest post? I'm just going down. Actually, I'm just copying this panel again. The whole panel, okay? I'm just copying the whole panel. And just pasting it here. And this is the comment area, okay? I'm just going to the browser and refreshing that. Now, this is the new latest post area, the the old one, the new one. But in the new one, what I'm just going to add actually here is the new one, okay? But before that, I'm just adding the comments as well because this is really important sometimes. Latest comments, okay? To clearing you that here, we're just starting the comments now. So, by the way, latest comments save that refresh that now this is the new thing which I just got so here first of all we don't need the image so I just removed the image now refresh that now obviously we have to images, Im remove the images from all of the TDs as well so I'm just removing that I got it save that and refresh back okay so the second thing is we have to okay I just didn't remove the image from the last one so now I just did that save that and refresh that now this is the new thing which I just did here but one thing more I just have to add here after the email I'm just adding another thing just duplicate that and the post okay post it means which post has the, got the comment so here I'm just typing post number two so now let's go to the browser and refresh that and new the, the new thing is this looking perfect so what more I have to do here I'm just copying this TR duplicating 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 and duplicating four times I just did this this should be two oh sorry not this should be five this should be four because I'm just coming from the last so this should be two and this is obviously the first one is the first one already so this is a new comment area and then I just have to add I'm just adding some more things okay and what more things I'm just going to add the list of users and the and actually specific users detail so now where I should add these things after the comments or after the uh, posts or I think before the post I have to add that thing so I'm just going at the top and this is the latest post area I got the clear comments area and here I'm just adding another thing and this way I'm just typing here press any space and the users area okay so this is the user area and what I'm just going to do here just simply copying the panel uh, the complete column here again okay simply and just paste that here okay what mistake I just made there oh the thing is there I just added an extra space that's why I just got that refresh that now this is the new thing which I just made here but this is not the thing which I just want because I'm just changing it and just making it approximately md7 and refresh that okay now instead of this I'm just adding the LG LG 3 save that and refresh that now this is the thing LG 6 refresh that back okay perfect or actually I'm just removing this column instead of the single columns a simple column I'm just copying the complete panel so or the panel is inside the actually here is the panel as well but I have to add the clear fix again that is a problem really simple so add that and refresh that now I just managed what I just want to do but here what I'm just going to do and how I'm just going to manage this problem this shouldn't be the comment area so I'm just removing the footer from there okay I just removed and the a tag as well and this is the panel heading after the uh, I'm just removing all the data inside the panel heading and after the panel heading I'm just adding the panel body panel body oh not in this way body looking perfect now go to the browser and refresh that this is the simple thing which I just got now okay 
So here in the panel heading, what I'm just going to add, I'm just adding the H4 again, and here inside the H4, I'm just typing the users list. Save that, and here again, I have to do the same thing. What the thing I have to do again, I'm just copying this, or just let's just create a new table, by the way. This is the new table, which I'm just going to create here. And obviously the T here and then inside the T here I'm just going to add some more things the TR okay and inside the TR what I'm just going to do TH TH and now this should be the S oh sorry S dot NO and duplicate this should be the name okay save that and then I'm just going to create the T body here okay t body cover that and now let's just go inside the t body what i'm just going to put inside the t body another tr and after the uh, the new tr what i'm just going to add the another td the first td actually and the sno should be one right now and then the name should be shazayv kumail and now save that Oh, sorry, not duplicate. Just copy the whole TR and paste that. And here, just type one, two, and just type John Mark because these two members I'll just make as users when we just make uh, when when I just make my CMS system workable. So, by the way, the admin panel actually workable. So here, the class I'm just adding table and then table. Stripped. Save that and refresh that. Now this is the thing which I just want to get and I got. So looking perfect. One thing more I just want to add here the the roles. Okay. So I'm just removing the name and just typing roles. Okay. So here. So here. This is the admin. Okay means it can change the things and this should be the subscriber only save that and not the rules actually only role now go to the browser and refresh that now this is the perfect thing which I just made here but what more I have to do now I'm just removing this uh, panel info and just typing here the primary okay save that and refresh that now this is the thing which I just made here okay so what more I'm just going to do, I'm just going to do the latest post area and where is that, this is the latest post area and this has the panel default as the style, so I'm just removing the default and just adding the uh, primary here as well, so okay, I'm just going to the uh, comments area, the latest comments area, and here, obviously this is the panel default, I'm just updating it to panel primary, go to the browser and refresh that, now this is looking more beautiful. So, I just did that and some more things I'll do in the next class. So, stay tuned and goodbye. Oh. One thing more I just want to add here in this area. So, what is the thing? I'm just going to the top and actually right now. I'm just going to make this area as the profile area of the logged in user. Okay. So, I'm just going here. And actually just copying this simple column just copying this and just pasting this after itself now go to the browser and refresh that now this is looking perfect okay so what more going to the notepad back and actually right now we don't need the table or actually we need the table but before the table we have to create some other things there this is the header header the user list here I'm just typing profile so, sorry the spelling mistake profile save that refresh that now this is a profile area and actually I'm just actually I'm just removing that I don't want the panel heading I'm just editing with this some new and interesting style and here the class I'm just setting the class here and then the page header okay here I'm just typing pro um, in the H4 I'm just typing the profile you know I just removed the panel heading okay 
just panel body directly now this is the profile area and what more I just I just want to do there to adding the balance I'm just going here and actually just simply copying this TR and duplicating it three times more okay because I just want to add some balance here this should be three this should be four and this should be five let's just save that and refresh that okay oh okay just cut all these three elements because we have to paste that here not there okay now refresh that now this is the more perfect thing but one more thing I just want to do I'm just here in the call six the second one call six I'm just cutting this page header and pasting inside the panel save that and refresh that now this is what I just got after that so okay what I'm just going to do more I'm just removing I'm just changing the table script to condense save that and refresh that okay I just put it the wrong spelling I think so I'm just going here and it should be condensed the S refresh that now it is looking the perfect thing which I just want so what more I'm just going to do here I'm just removing the actually the table heading it from here okay we don't need the heading now just simply refresh that now this is what I just want but I will add the heading by the way but in some other ways so there after the profile heading I'm just going I'm just adding the picture of mine or any other person actually okay so first of all I'm just changing it and just typing 4 and it should be 8 okay the previous one and save that and refresh that this is looking more preferred and more perfect so here I'm just adding my profile picture okay so this is the page panel heading and I'm just putting this inside a column okay the class of column okay you know that columns are really important in the website uh, when we're just talking about the bootstrap so here it should be the column uh, MD4 okay now just cut this panel heading and put it inside the MD4 but actually I just did the wrong thing here okay I'm just cutting this panel uh, column MD because I just forgot that this is a user's area and I'm just duplicating that and here I'm just typing the or uh, cut that and here I have to type the thing but before that I'm just pasting this column mb4 and here I'm just adding the comment area okay this is really important I just found that profile area okay now this is what I just want to do perfect just clearing what I just want now I simply just cut this page header and just paste this inside this m column md4 and just go to the browser and refresh that now this is uh, uh, looking more perfect and here I'm just adding I'm just creating another div which is actually the another class another column md8 okay in this column I'm just adding the img and src and what I'm just typing here the images actually I got the image of a model on my folder named images but before but for going the image I have to add the back directory thing so here is the model.jpg and then the width, the width should be 100 oh sorry not in this way yep 100 percent and the class I'm just going to add the class here as well so the class should be img oh, um, circle okay cover that save that go to the browser refresh that now I got the image okay oh mine this is too big so let us type 50 percent refresh that okay this is still too big so just put the instead of 50 I'm just typing 30 percent or refresh that okay and now what I'm just going to do here I'm just typing 7 refresh that okay this is looking really perfect but actually not too much here instead of the profile I'm just typing my name or uh, yeah the June is more preferred because obviously that is not me by the way so refresh that and this is June mark my dummy corrector for this beautiful admin panel okay June mark perfect so what more I'm just going to do here I'm just going to create another div 
and this div should have the class and now this is actually the panel heading okay I'm just setting the panel heading now but why I just added the panel heading and actually what I'm just going to do here I'm just copying and pasting all the things of this table okay first of all I'm just deleting the numbers here I'll teach you what I'm just going to do here okay simply just cutting and actually just copying all the data of this panel okay and just pasting this inside the panel heading now go to the browser and refresh that now you can see that this is in full blue color this is what I just want to get so perfectly looking and now there this should be the role in the this should be the th by the way th and here role okay the role is the this should be admin by the way or unfortunately I have to type the Shazaib Kamal by the way that is not my picture <laughs> Kamal now the role is admin save that go to the browser and refresh that now this is the Shazaib Kamal and the role is admin and the other things are if you have some other things let's just type that I can add my contact number my email address here so I'm just adding my email address and again I'm just copying the th here and just pasting and adding the email okay and here I'm just typing the ABC or my email address no problem save that and some more things I'm just going to add here let's just copy this tr and paste that and here I'm just adding the contact number and just correct that and here I'm just adding the one two three four five six seven eight nine zero okay don't try to call that number because I don't know whose one has that number by the way so here this is the more preferred refresh that now I got the uh, I, I just perfectly added all the things there well I can add some more things and can make this area more perfect so what I'm just going to increase on that I'm just going to the um, notepad plus and plus plus and just copying this role admin duplicating that and here I'm just typing um, job okay journal job for example I am the um, developer okay web developer okay here I got the role of admin but actually I am my, my job is to is actually a developer so I just mentioned that well for adding for just actually balancing the areas I'm just adding another thing here just actually copying this contract and pasting here here I'm just typing the country okay I'm just mentioning that I belong to Pakistan so I'm just typing Pakistan here instead of the number I'm just typing Pakistan save and refresh that now this is actually perfect thing so add the semicolon here and perfect so guys we'll meet in next class